Hey everyone, welcome back. Uh, today I have another subscription for you. We're gonna take a look at the January Birch Box. So stay tuned and let's see what's inside. Shut up and sit down. I feel like a Pomeranian with my hair today. Anyways, um, so I recently re-signed up for Birchbox. I wanted to give it another try. The first time I tried it, I wasn't really a fan, but I wanted to see if anything had changed since it had been a while um, since I had that subscription. So I signed up for their buy one, get one sale. Um, you got uh, the January, January birch box, um, but then you also got a second birch box for a dollar. So I'm interested to see what are in these two boxes. I don't know which one is which, so um, let's just dive right in. First one we're gonna look at is the blue one that's here, and it looks like it's almost like a little jewelry box that you pull it, you pull it out, and it reveals everything inside. So let's take a look. So in this particular box, it looks like we have five items here. Um, this is a little information card. So this card says, it's easier to prevent dry skin than fix it. So change your nighttime skincare routine if you wake up with dry skin. That seems self-explanatory. So let's see what we actually have in this box here. Um, all right, so the first thing we have is this beauty protector, protect and detangle leave in detangler. Um, it says that this is paraben and sulfate free detangler. It also provides against UV rays and heat styling while preventing color from fading. Uh, spray all over towel dried hair and comb through. Um, I'm actually interested in this. Um, the Protecting color from fading. I'm kind of a little concerned about that because if you have a natural colored hair, it tends to work a little bit differently than if you have non-natural colored hair, like my hair is purple. So certain things that are color protecting actually make my color look worse. So I'm curious as to if there's any oils in here because oils will pull out color. And I'm not seeing that it does have oils, so I'm actually kind of excited to try this. I've never used this brand before, so. It actually smells pretty good. Like, it doesn't smell overly perfumey like a lot of stuff does, so. Um, but if you're interested in this beauty protector, the full size is $23.50. This is actually a travel size, I'm going to assume. Um, since most everything here are deluxe samples or samples. But it does look like we did get one full-size product. Okay, so this is the Butter Lip and Cheek Balm by Butanique Beauty London. And it says here that this buttery lip and cheek balm has apricot oil, so it not only gives you a natural dewy rose flush, it moisturizes your skin, blend directly onto lips and cheeks. So. It's kind of cool. So here's so here's the color here. It looks like a very, very nice kind of apricot color. Just get some. All right, so I'm just gonna see kind of how it feels on the skin. I mean, it does feel like it could be a little bit moisturizing. I'm not overly a huge fan of the texture, um, putting it on, but once it kind of sits on the skin, it does look really pretty. So if I wanted to do like a natural kind of no makeup sort of look, this may be something um, that I would apply with this. Now I believe this is the full size. It says the full size is... $16 and this is in the shade Coco Rose. Next we have Extension Plus Curl Mascara from Marcel. It's a curling and lengthening mascara. 
The mascara's uniquely shaped wand is designed to hug your eye's natural curves so it can reach every lash with its curling and lengthening formula. Now I have tried many curling mascaras. My lashes grow straight and they refuse to hold the curls. So I may give this one a try. Um, this is the wand. It does have that little curve there. It does seem to be a little bit more curved than some of the other mascaras out there. Um, and I'm curious as to if it has fibers in it because a lot of times the lengthening mascaras do. And I'm just gonna go ahead and just put some on my hand here. It does not look like it has fibers in it. So if you don't like a fiber mascara, this may be good. Um, it says that the full size of this is $15. This is a travel size. All right, next we have Dr. Lip Original Nipple Balm for dry skin, luscious lips, and glossy bits. Now, no matter how many times I try to read this, and that is exactly what it says, I will never be able to do that without laughing. So we're just gonna roll with it. Um, so this is a multi-purpose, 100% natural formula. It works to rehydrate the skin and lips, soothe sunburns, tame unruly brows, and nourish thirsty cuticles. Um, I just, I don't even know where to start. I don't. So we're just gonna put some on my hand here and kind of see what this formula is like. All right. Ooh. Okay, so if anyone's ever used like that Utter Balm or a Vaseline, this is definitely what it feels like. And it's super sticky and tacky. I don't know if I would wear this during the day, um, but I, like as a lip mask, I feel like this would be really good for like an overnight sort of thing. Or if you have super, super dry lips, um, I usually don't and I don't like how sticky it is on the skin. So this I would reserve for nighttime, like when you go to bed, you're finished doing everything, put it on your lips before you go to sleep. And then when you wake up, your lips will be nice and fresh. Um, you can do it for sun sunburns apparently. Um, I'm not 100% sure, but I may have to try it because being as pale as I am living in Florida, I do get sunburned quite a bit. Okay. Next, we have a pie chamomile and rosehip calming day cream. Now, it says here that this repairing moisturizer has a natural skin soothing agent for a calmer complexion with less redness. You massage onto a clean face and neck in the morning and you follow with SPF. Um, let's see what we got. I'm worried about some creams being too heavy for daytime. Um, I have sensitive skin, so if I use a day cream that's too heavy, I can break out a lot um this one okay it does smell a lot <coughs> like flowers um if you have allergies this may not be a good thing for you um because that chamomile smell is really really strong but i don't even think it's chamomile i think it's actually the rose hip yeah it's definitely the rose hip so i may not be using this because i just i'm not going to be able to um, get past the smell and then I definitely can't use anything that has rose hip or rose hip oil in it because it does break me out um, but if you are interested in this it's $60 for the full size um, and I will link everything down in the description below for this box so you can take a look at the products that came in it all right so that's the first one going back through everything i think maybe the only thing i might use is going to be the um lip and cheek balm maybe every now and again i definitely want to try the mascara and the leave-in detangler conditioner leave-in detangler and the um dr lip original nipple balm <laughs> I'm gonna try this as a lip mask and see how it works, um, especially since it is still the cooler months. I do have dry lips sometimes. Oh my gosh. All right, so moving on to the second box is, this one is a kind of very pretty vanilla in gold. And it is embossed, so it 
actually reflects a lot of the light. Um, this one does not actually pull out like the other one. Instead, it is a flip top. And it looks like that this is almost like a frame and it has like a saying on here, um, just a little poem. And it looks like it has like a three card thing. So I'm sure if you wanted to, you could double this as a jewelry box or use it as a frame. All right, so this says happy holidays, however and when you celebrate it. And it's a coupon here. Um, maybe this one was the one for Christmas, I'm not sure. Um, let's see what the card is. It says, as we close out the year, we just wanted to take a moment to thank you. We know life is full and we couldn't be more grateful that a few minutes each month we get to help you find something for you. We wouldn't be Birchbox without you. Cheers to you and the year to come. So this must have been the one for December, which is okay. Um, all right, so looking at this one, the first thing we got is the Beauty Protector Protect and Detangle. Deja vu anybody? Okay, so if I definitely don't like this, then I have two that um, I can probably give to a friend and maybe one I'll do in a giveaway since I have duplicates here. So moving on since we already kind of covered that one. All right, so the next thing we have here is the Brigio Be Gentle, Be Kind Matcha and Apple Replenishing Superfood Shampoo and Conditioner. Um, I've actually tried Brigio before and I really like their products. Um, I'm not sure if this one has oils in it. Again, that's something that I really have to be careful with. It looks like it does have avocado oil, um, almond oil. So I may have to use this with caution. Maybe like right before I dye my hair, I can do a nice treatment with it. Um, I'm gonna open it because I wanna see what it smells like. All right. Ooh, that smells so good. All right, so it definitely smells more like green apple. Like it almost smells like a, if you were to put a Jolly Rancher in a tea, like that's exactly what this smells like. Um, so it says that this is enriched with apple and matcha. So it's kind of a full serving of fruits and veggies in your shower. The sulfate free shampoo is tough on oil and build up yet gentle on hair. I do love that it is sulfate free because that will make less of my color wash out. So if you have a color treated hair, um, this may be something that you wanna try. So we're gonna move on. Looks like we have a brow liner. This is the Ico London Brow Liner Shape and Define. And it is a waterproof brow pen that can fill in sparse spots and make your eyebrows look naturally fuller. Apply a light short strokes and upward motion moving from your inner brow outward. Um, it says that this is in the shade medium. Let's do a swatch and see how it looks. Oh, what is that? Okay, so that definitely does not look like a medium brown. It definitely looks more like a green brown, maybe like more for blondes or something. Um, I'm gonna give this a second and see kind of how it dries down but that is not a color that I want to put on my eyebrows. That just looks gross. Like, okay, not exaggerating, it does remind me a lot of split pea soup, right? Am I crazy? Let me know. Moving on while well, that kind of maybe does something. Um, this is the Love of Color One and Done Shadow Stick in Champagne Problems. And this says that it is a waterproof shadow stick that gives up to 11 hours of creaseless color with no brush, blender, or primer needed. To sharpen, you use the sharpener available on birchbox.com. Okay, that kind of stinks because a lot of times with these crayons, they do tend to have sharpeners in the end. It doesn't look like this one does, but I'm interested to see what the color looks like. Wow, that is a really pretty color. Okay, look how shimmery and shiny that is. I feel like I definitely want to just use this. Why not? We're gonna do it. All right, so 
I think I really like it. Um, it definitely gives you that nice little pop of highlight. Easy to use under the brow bone. You can use it in your inner corner. Sometimes I even like to um, highlight my lower lash line on the inner corner. It doesn't seem like it smudges very much. Um, once it sets, I'm sure it will last a pretty long time. So we're gonna see, oh my gosh, that still looks like split pea soup. I don't see how that's a medium brown. Anyway, moving on. Okay. The last thing we have here is Real Chemistry Luminous 3-Minute Peel. Um, and it says here that this is a gentle acid-free peel. It visibly lifts off dead skin cells so you can get a gorgeous glow. You massage onto clean, dry skin for 15 to 20 seconds, then rinse off the solids that appear. Wait, what? All right, so I'm gonna read the directions because I'm kind of confused by this. Um, so you're gonna clean your skin and you leave it slightly damp. You're gonna spread the gel thinly and quickly over your forehead, cheeks, chin, and neck, and decollete. Quickly begin massaging these areas in circular motions with slightly damp hands. After 15 to 20 seconds, solids should form under the fingertips. That means the peel is activating correctly and the gel is now combining with your dead skin proteins. You massage for two to three minutes until all of the gel has complete combined with dead skin and you cleanse again. Okay, so this definitely kind of works like um, like a serum peel than a mask peel. So I'm actually kind of interested to try this. Should I do a video? Would you like to see a first impressions video using this mask? Let me know in the comments and if so, I'll do it. Um, okay, so looking back through the second box that we got, so the Real Chemistry uh, three minute peel is $48 for the full size. This is a sample size. Um, I'm definitely interested in trying this one as well as the Brigio, um Be Gentle, Be Kind shampoo and conditioner. They retail for $28 each for the full size. These are definitely travel sized. Um, the Love of Color when it's on shadow stick, like I'm probably going to be using this nonstop. Um, the Ico brow liner is going to go in the trash because I'm not going to put this on my eyebrows. It just, it's not going to work for me. Um, and the next thing is the uh, Protect and Detangle. Um, again, I'm interested in trying it, but I will put this one in a giveaway portion since I do already have one. So maybe I will do a giveaway soon for that. All right, guys, that is all of these, uh, the birch box that I have for you. And if you are interested in getting the birch box or if you're interested in trying out a new subscription, it is $11 a month. They are still running their BOGO sale. So you pay $11, you get the uh, second box for an additional dollar. Um, and then it is a monthly subscription service. So I'll link everything down in the description so you can take a look at any products that you may be interested in trying. Let me know what you would like to see in upcoming videos and don't forget to follow me all over the socials and I will see you in the next video. Bye.